This is where we spent our first night on the streets of New York. I'm going to the Rubin Museum of Art in New York City. It bills itself as one of the few museums in the world dedicated to Himalayan and uh, uh, related areas of art. A 500-year-old painting said uh, described as pigment or cloth. I assume that means oil. You see the fine detail work. And this is ink on paper. The intertwining and overlapping. All of it done without error. Carved ivory. The artwork of the Naga tribes and Naga warriors located between India and Burma. Ceremonial weapons. These are worn for both warmth and for status. Jewelry, a lot of it metal and bone various wood carvings from the area. A very narrow waist for men was considered to be attractive. So they wore girdles. Baskets and dishes woven in wood. The unseen referring to the back of the artwork on the back of this one is written a purification ritual. Lord to the charnel ground worth looking at for its detail work. the 19th century. Benji and the Big City. He's been quite alert to uh, what's been going on around him. We're driving along uh, Park Avenue, which by the way does not go by the park, uh, not Central Park anyway. Uh, we'll turn at the next intersection and uh, head over in that direction. We're in Central Park and you really do get away from it all in here. Still a lot of people, of course. A chance coming out of Central Park, I found myself in Times Square. It was time to take a break, so we stopped at a park, uh, which happened to have a dog park. There's Benji in the far corner, you can see his tail. Dinosaur State Park, containing one of the largest concentration of dinator, dinosaur tracks in a single layer of rock anywhere in North America. 2,000. After spending the night in the streets of this clearly upscale neighborhood in Providence, Rhode Island, I spotted this uh, piece of artwork sitting in the front lawn. This is the first state house of Rhode Island. 
and also the uh, presently housing the Preservation Commission where I'm going to be turning in the uh, ground penetrating radar report that I have. May 4th, 1776. The House of Deputies in this room passed. The House of Magistrates, the same date, concurring. The Act constituting Rhode Island the first free and independent republic in America and asserting her absolute independence of England two months before the Declaration of Independence in Philadelphia. We're in New Haven, Massachusetts, where they have the USS Massachusetts on display along with several other ships that can be toured. Tall Tower is a Pilgrim Monument. We're in Provincetown, uh, Massachusetts. This is where the Mayflower first landed and they signed the Mayflower Compact. Uh, they didn't stay here, they went on down to Plymouth and uh, established their colony. and to provide a nuclear strike capability against the Western Hemisphere. This is the uh, map of Cuba that Kennedy used. Uh, Soviet submarines almost uses a uh, nuclear torpedo against the uh, U.S. Navy. Two American uh, pilots invade Soviet airspace. One of them was shot down. Khrushchev backs off. 